Hello everybody, I am here today showing you guys a simple fix for the configuration tool.exe error in Sonic Generations once you first get it and launch it up. And sometimes it has this error on certain PCs and I would today just be showing you guys how to fix it. So go ahead and open up your Windows Explorer browser and open to your computer. If you don't have this simple bar right down here, go ahead go home and click on computer. This will open up one right here, and I don't know why that's open over there. Don't worry about that. So next thing you want to do is go ahead and open up this file up. If you have 32-bit windows, you want to go into program files. If you have 64-bit, you want to go to program files x86. I have 64-bit, so I'll be heading in here today. So let's scroll down until you find your Steam folder and double click in there to get inside and then go ahead and find your steam apps folder go ahead double click and get inside your common folder is your first folder on the top and go ahead and go to your sonic generations folder what you're going to want to do is delete all the config files these are the default stuff that you need to run sonic generations and it will ask you to run it for the first time Okay, now that that's gone, let's go ahead and open up Steam. Let's go ahead, go down to Sonic Generations and see what it says. It will ask you to f configure your graphics. Now, as you notice, you didn't come up with that error, so you want to go to your configuration tool. <sighs> um, so, this is the menu you want to see just go ahead and set up your settings and all that type of stuff so go ahead and save and quit and then if you launch it it should be very simple and you could just play it Sega. yep okay so that was the tutorial on how to get your sonic generations working again with the configuration tool.exe error hope you guys enjoyed see you guys next time